What is up everybody? Welcome back to my channel, Mate Dog Official, and today I'm back with another video. So today I'm gonna be going over my predictions for the 2021 Tokyo Olympics for swimming. And I'm not gonna be doing every event, but I'm gonna be doing ones that I have decided to do and I think that are important. Comment down what events I should do for the next part of this video, and I will probably do that. Also, comment down video ideas in the comments because I'm running out of ideas. So yeah, let's get in the video. We're gonna be starting with the men's 100 meter backstroke and I'll pull it up. So as you can see, the top two swimmers are Russian and both of their times have been done in 2021. They are just one 100th apart and they have a 52, 12 and 52, 13. So this entire top eight is going to be really good contenders at the Olympics and it's going to be really close. I think that Ryan Murphy will get top three. I'm not sure who Evgeny Rylov is. Sorry if I said that wrong, but he seems to be very good. So Ryan Murphy is the world record holder. I think that he might win it actually. I think second place might go to either the Chinese swimmer or one of the Russian swimmers. And then third place will be a toss up. So that's my take on the 100 backstroke. Next is the women's mile. I obviously think that Katie Ledecky is gonna win. Her seat time is ahead of second places by a lot. And I think that she will win because she is the best at distance in the world. So yeah, that is not really a question. I think that Erica Sullivan might be close to top three. She's from the United States. I think that second place will be Simona Quadarella. I have not really heard of her before, but she looks like she's a really fast seed time. So I think she'll do well. Next is the men's 100 free. I think that Caleb Jessel will win. He is one of the best sprinters of all time. And he's probably the fastest swimmer in the world right now. I think that Kyle Chalmers will be really close second. As you can see, his seed time is a 47.08, which is really fast. And I think Caleb Dressel will beat the world record. I think he's going to go under a 46.5, maybe in a 46 low. And I think Kyle Chalmers will break 47 seconds. Next up to the men's 50 freestyle. I think that Caleb Dressel will win this as well. He's going to break 21, get the world record. He did that time in 2019, but he's been on top of it lately. So I think that he will win. I think that Bruno Frades will get second. I think Michael Andrew will get third. Michael Andrew has been really fast lately and he only needs to drop a tenth and a half to be on the third place seed time. So yeah. Now the woman's freestyle. I think that Sarah, not sure how to say her last name, is gonna win. She is probably one of the best sprint, woman sprinters in the world. She, I think has the 100 flyer world record. And then I think one of the Australians will get second. I think Simone Manuel will get third, even though she's getting a little bit older. And yeah, and the last event for this video is gonna be the men's 200 freestyle. I think that none of the Americans is gonna get top three. I think that Duncan Scott or Tom Dean is going to win. I'm not sure who Dana's Rapsis is, but I think that they're going to get top three looking at their seed time. And an underdog in this event is Kieran Smith from the United States. He could do really well. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video. Comment down video ideas and also events I should do. Anyways, that is the video there. Thank you everybody for watching. I'll see you next one. Peace out.